A South Jersey artist is using his creative talent to raise awareness of the Black Lives Matter movement and those who have become symbols for change. In this justice and understanding story, Eyewitness News reporter Trang Doe shows us how the artist's unique works of art are opening eyes and minds. 3,400 Skittles, countless man hours sorting, painting, and hot gluing them to a 30 by 40 canvas. The result, a striking portrait of Trayvon Martin. The 17 year old's killing made national headlines in 2012 after he was gunned down by a man who told a 911 dispatcher the teen looked suspicious. Officers found no weapons on Martin, just a bag of Skittles in his pocket. Trayvon Martin came in my head right away. Courtney Newman is the artist behind the portrait. His art covers a range of topics from the female form to celebrities to music. But he also doesn't shy away from tackling difficult subject matter, especially now. Awareness not going to get raised by itself. You want that art to uh, make the people mind, just have a different perspective of what they think. Newman enjoys the added challenge of working with unusual materials. In some pictures, it's about to see if I could succeed. I'm just trying to get to the goal of to push it forward to, to, a different, to a different level. Bullet casings, some left raw and others painted black, shape the faces of these dual 50 by 50 portraits of civil rights icons Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. and Malcolm X. A lot of people tell me fascinating, fascinating, and then, you know, they say decent. It's, it's creative. Newman's mother, Crystal, says her son, who has epilepsy, is a man of few words. Instead, his art speaks for him. Being a black man, you know, that ex experience, you know, discrimination, you know, from time to time, um, it's on his mind, you know what I mean? And who better to draw or focus his uh, art on but a black activist, Martin Luther King. You know, Malcolm X. He's currently working on a piece featuring George Floyd, Ahmaud Arbery, and Breonna Taylor, whose deaths have spurred a wave of activism nationwide against racism and police brutality. The way that people protest, it, it some of them ways pave the advance away for the future. I'll stay to the side and, and paint the picture. <laughs> Let the people view the picture. It's hopefully it make a standpoint for the future and not just African American, but but people, period. From Pensalkin, I'm Trang Do, CBS three eyewitness news. Amazing. Still